Hi guys, and welcome to a brand new episode of Pokemon Jewel. Today I'm looking again in depth at how to use Fusion. I'm going to explain everything that you need to know about Blue Cubes. We're going to be looking at the variations, how much experience that they can give you, and also the max experience that you need to get your characters to level 5. Additionally, I've gone and looked at how many coins you need to get your characters to level 5, and I'm astonished, X-Rares need a lot, so start saving. So let's go ahead. As you can see on my deck, I have currently got all the variations you can get. So we have common, that gives 500 experience towards your character. We have uncommon, which gives 1000 experience towards your character. We have rare, which gives 4500 experience. And we have an X rare, 10,500 experience. Now, let's look at the individual Pokemon at level one and how much experience they need. We have an uncommon Mudkip. You can see that that would max out to level five. Let's take them away. That would max out, that needs 180 experience to level up. Compare that to a common Pokemon and it only needs 100. Looking at rare, so I'll get my Skarmory. A rare needs only it needs 720, so there's a significant jump when it goes to rare Pokemon, and an even bigger one when we look at uh, X rare Pokemon. This Charizard needs 1,600. So I've gone ahead and looked up exactly how much you need each level, and I will be displaying that on the side. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to attach this to, I'm going to post this in Reddit and I'll put the link below for you guys to check out if you're interested in looking at it. So we have common, first of all. Level 2, to get there you need 100 experience. Level 3, 225 more. Level 4, 1000. And level 5 to get it max, you need 5000 more. A total cost of 6,325 to ax out a common Pokemon. Not a lot, with one X-Ray you'd be able to do that. And the cost is also, I worked out the cost, and that would cost you two, 200, 21,108 coins to max that out. Then we look at Uncommon. So Uncommon start at 180 as we've seen, then 405 for level 3, 1,800 for level 4, and 9,000, giving it a total of 11,385 experience to evolve that. Now you're going to need 37,933 coins if you want to max that out. Then we go to rare. There's a big jump here. 720 experience to max that to, to get to level 2. 1,620 to get to level 3. 7,200 to get to level 4. And a whopping 36,000 to get to level 5. Making a total of 45,000 and and 40. <laughs> and that will cost you a massive 150,000 coins. So you're going to need a lot of quests completed and a lot of X rare um, yellow ingots. So again, quests, as you complete more, you start to get more gold for each level. So it's, they're going to be a lot more coins to get in the future. Uh, then we go to X rare, and this is massive. 1,600 to get to level 2, 3,600 3, to get to level 3, 16,000 to get to level 4, and 80,000 to get to level 5. Now, that's not too bad because I've, I've, I've got a lot of X-Rares, but this cost is massive. 337,720,000. Now, I don't know that exact, but I've worked out that when you times 600, so a common Pokemon, what I've done is times 6,325, 6, and you have to times it by 3.3371415016 reoccurring. Now that took a lot to work out, but if you use that and put that into uncommon Pokemon, so times that by 11,385, you get the same cost. So it looks like they've got the same times varied multiple for each of those to work out the cost of your Pokemon. And that means that if, if that is true, um, then we're looking about 337,720 for X rare Pokemon. It may be a little bit out, it may be two or one or three out, but it's pretty accurate. 
it, it, and it matches both of those two values when I've put it in. So just a head up guys for those, that's just to help you out so you know exactly what you're going to need to get each Pokemon to the level that you want it to be. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I mean by how much experience it takes to level up each level. So let's just take a common Pokemon, um, I'm going to use Poliwag. So it needs 100 experience to level up the first level. I'm just going to use that because a 500 cube is too much. It takes it to level 2, it needs 225. If I put a 500 XP cube on there, it takes it up to needing 1000. It's currently on level 3. So then I'm going to use a rare cube. That takes it up to level 4 and that needs 5000 experience. And now finally, I'm probably going to use one of my X cubes. That would take it to level 5. I'm not going to use that. So this you can use the what the experience that I've showed you to calculate just how much you need if you only just want to put one Pokemon on. I mean, I can just, um, let's say, well, who should I sacrifice? Just got Electabuzz. I want to keep him. Um, let's sacrifice Mighty Yenna. And another 500 XP, which is Pokemon. Oh, actually, I've got another cube. So I'll use that. And that takes it to level 5. It would have been a waste to use my 10,000 experience Pokemon. So you hit Fusion. That's going to take 21,000 coins, 108. Um, evolve it. Sacrifices all those cubes, they disappear, and it takes it straight up to level 5. And in level 5, you can do what you always do, is upgrade your disc and expand it. Now, Poliwag is quite a good Pokemon because it has hypnosis, and putting Pokemon to sleep is really good. So, I'll hit OK on that. Spend gems to revert this change. Yes. So there we have a maxed out level 5 Pokemon. Now I can't give it any more experience, so look, everything else is blanked out. And all I can do now is upgrade the chain level of that Pokemon by using green cubes of common type or above, uh, but you need 30 of them, so that's going to take a while. So all in all, a lot of experience is needed to max out a Pokemon. I mean, checking out, the, to max out an X-Rare, 101,200. You're going to need 10 X rare cubes to be able to max them out. So get saving and use them wisely. I hope this has been helpful. And like I say, the link below will, uh, will take you to um, all of the information that I've had in this video. Now that's not all for this video. I've got an exciting thing that I'm bringing to the channel and hopefully you guys get involved. So, what I'm going to be doing every Saturday is challenging one of you to a match. I'm going to be doing it every week and giving you guys the opportunity to win something if you beat me. Now I'm hoping obviously that I can start to rack up an undefeated title, but if you beat me, you're going to get a prize. So the first prize that I'm going to offer, now this is actually a prize that if you watch the YouTube reversal, I made for him, but he just hasn't been in contact and I've had them for about three months now. So I thought I'm going to use them for my channel. What I've got here is four handmade by personally by me um, silhouette poker coasters so if I open these I'll show you what what you can get we have tie this up good we have a silhouette Pikachu uh, Pichu sorry we have a silhouette Hoot Hoot there is a silhouette Eevee and a silhouette Gengar so hopefully you guys are interested in that and if you want to get involved what you have to do hit the subscribe button and post below a comment just saying I challenge you and what I'll do on Saturday I will pick somebody at random I will start a room give you my nickname and put a, a and send you the code for that room that way we can battle and what I'll do is I'll film that battle and I'll put it up on the channel hoping that I don't get my first uh, first loss but guys get your decks good get looking good and hopefully you'll be picked to have a challenge I'm really excited about it so that's all for this video hopefully you've enjoyed it if you have hit the like button and if you want to keep up to date with future content hit that subscribe button that's all from me see you next time